Life wasn't easy. I was a freshly divorced duck. Not able to pay next month's rent. Not that I had paid for it this month yet. My brain felt foggy. And I was trying to remember. Where did all my money go? I had to retrace last night's steps. Uh, our first case. What did we do with our money? Deductions a vital part of detective work. Find clues, words by a questioning person, insisting on your surroundings. Into clues, into the blank spaces to do deduction. The nest egg. Somebody spent his her last money on something for something. Find more clues. My last money. A couple of coins and a button. Not even enough to take a return bus trip. Okay, let's find clues. What's this? I won't be needing this badge anymore. I guess I can keep it as a souvenir. My new job as the duck detective isn't going any better though. <sighs> well, if things keep going badly, I can always sell it online. Hey. What no one? messages. This fresh smell. Oh, sweet spongy loaf. Oh, you keep me safe at night. That's some nice bread. <sighs> I took that photo of her in a secluded tulip field. We spoke for hours under the stars that night. And now, she doesn't even answer my texts. Rough. <sighs> I took that photo of her in a secluded tulip. We spoke for hours. And now, uh -huh. she doesn't even answer my texts. If you're over here, my second <laughs> overdue notice. I wonder at what point they start kicking people out. Let's not find out. I can't believe Anna actually filed the divorce papers. I have everything I need to solve this now. Okay. Well, who spent the money? I think that's the dark detective. What did he spend the money on? The bread was smelling awfully fresh. He was giving it to himself. Ah, not my proudest moment, but the toast helps me to forget. Good toast. I can't believe Anna actually filed the divorce papers. I have everything I need. But we solved the case. Let's keep going. Oh, oh! Knocked over the trash. What's calling? Hannah! I'm a different duck now. I haven't had a, a slice of bread in weeks. You oh, have to believe me! Uh, <clears throat> oh. Yeah, have you speaking to the duck detective? Let's discuss this in person. I'll be there in an hour. Oof. Okay. It's the duck detective. I spent more than half of my remaining cash on the bus fare. And here I was. In front of Bear Bus Office. Some sort of... Rundown coal center. I better crack this case, or I won't even have enough money to make it back home. Okay. There's a clue here. New bus route starting in August. Visit the scenic mountains of South Sicia. I'd always tell Anna we'd go there one day.
Oh, somebody's upset. I'm staying here until I get my money back. Ooh. Bear bus? <laughs> More like scam bus. You uh, sound unhappy. You bet I am. Their stupid buses always arrive late. I came back from a work trip to the west and arrived here at three in the morning. And they don't even want to give me a refund. How much did you pay? Hmm, too smart. But that's not the point! It's about the principle. Let's see, not the principle. I could already tell based on her face that the receptionist was a tough one. She wouldn't make life easy for me. But I had to make my way into the office. Oh, we have an appointment, right? Ooh, sorry about I'm that. Duck Detective. I'm here to investigate a case. Okay. Do you work here? Uh, no. Well, then I can't let you in. But I've been hired by someone from Bearbus. Who hired you? Um, I didn't catch their name. Listen, buddy. You better get out of here, or I'll have to call security. There's always more to people than you might think. I should take a closer look and figure out what she's about. Hey. Okay. Let's see what's going on then. Question. Inspect. It's magnifying glass. Uncover clothes, okay. I swear to God, if someone steals my mug again, I will end them. Uh oh, that doesn't sound good. Mug stolen. Laura from CS is way too loud. I can hear her keyboard all the way to my desk. Huh. It's Sophie's birthday next Thursday. Just saying. Oh. Sophie. Eh? Birthday. Suggestions. Yeah. Oh. First name Laura. are quite mundane. I'm surprised nobody wrote something more scandalous. Oh. Giraffe. Cute. Smiley happy. September. The 7th is today. Friday. Need to remember to collect my dry cleaning. Okay. Detective work isn't easy. You need to pay attention to everything you see and hear. There must have been something I overlooked. Oh, I needed to backtrack. The thing that bothered me in particular was. Seeing. Suspect's name. Once I knew the first and last name, I had to write them down in the suspects page of my notebook. Ah. Entrance. Okay. Somebody is feeling something because something has her uh, okay I, I think I see where this is going
keychain. What about the K-pop fan? Okay. I should be able to deduce her name now. Okay. Oh, ah, uh, okay. So we have to guess her name, so... Not K-pop fan, for sure. Sophie, there you go. Ah, uh, I see. Okay, okay. I should be able to figure out what's going on with her. I need to check my notes in the deduction section. Okay, so she was crying, so she's feeling sad because. Uh, has stolen because nobody there you go nobody has remembered her birthday ah, that's why she's making such a face I should try and cheer her up how can we cheer her up you're still here? Let's just say happy birthday, see what happens. I'm just here to wish you a happy birthday. <gasps> How did you know? Just another one of Duck Detective's great deductions. Huh? Uh, anyway, that was really nice of you. No one else remembered, can you believe it? If what? you know my birthday, you must have a connection to someone here. Here's the key card to the office. Ooh. That was easy. Okay. Uh, let's go into the stay out. It says server room. Oh. It's locked. Okay. Let's try the other door. Aha. Stained carpets and peeling wallpaper exuded a stench of stale coffee and abandoned dreams. I knew I couldn't stay long or it would rub off on me. Oh, this is the last straw! Fredersen needs to be fired! I'll see what I can do. Fredersen. Who are you? Do you have a problem? If you have one, just call our damn hotline. I'm Eugene McQuacklin, the duck detective. A client hired me to investigate a case. Why didn't you just say so? It's time we put an end to the awful lunch death. All uh. we need to fire him is some evidence for the upper management. I'll be in my office. Uh. So he's the one who hired I had to find out who works here and what their jobs are. I needed to find my client as well. Thankfully, I remembered the piece of paper I had in my jacket from taking notes during the call. Uh -huh. Let's get the note. Uh, evidence. Ooh. Hastily wrote this for heading to the client's address. Yes. It there, I guess. Oh, we got a map. Very nice. Client. Somebody hired the doc detective because he, she. Uh, lunch was stolen by a co worker known as blank. We'll find out the suspects. A raft that works. Oh, Sophie. Oh, okay. So we don't know they work. There, so we need to find out who the titles are. Okay, okay. We can do that. No. Detective of my 
already require new perspective. Press H for additional guidance. Ooh. Detective work isn't easy. Okay. I was sure I would be able to crack this. Detective work isn't easy. Okay. I was That's sure pondering. I would be able to crack this. Okay. Let's see, what's this? It's a list of all the bus drivers. The most busy driver out of all four seems to be Petrovich. Okay. What's this? All this. Station. Okay. It's one. It's cargo. Okay. So that's where we were gonna take. Wrestle. Okay. Mm, okay, that's everything. Their now we know where the bus. Go very far. Okay. So that's salami. What's this? Spotless, good condition. See, expensive Western currency. Salami, high quality. See, certain lifestyle. Eh? A lot of salami. I see. Laura, custom mug. You don't strike me as a Laura. No name tag. Oh. Buckle shoes. Lame. Let's see. Let's talk to them. I'm the only one here in the operating office. Can you imagine? I plan all office. the bus routes and make sure the buses are on time. <laughs> Isn't that so cool? Don't you have an angry customer shouting outside about the buses being late? I, uh... Really? Uh, see, what's key? Do you have any idea who picked me to investigate? <laughs> no idea, but I'm so happy you're here. I have a copy of your book. The early bird catches the criminal. Can you sign oh. it? We're famous. I... Yeah. I guess so. Woo! <laughs> Thanks so much, Mr. Duck Detective. I won't ever forget this. This will become a core memory. <sighs> I understood that reference. Oh, what's this? Two desks on this side look unused. Over trash cans. Okay, let's have a look at you. Different brand, own headset, dedicated. Strained eyes, insomnia. This energy drink. Bad habits. Not anybody to talk about bad habits with our red. This is Bear Bus. How can I help you? Ugh, this is the third time you're calling. I'm telling you, your ex-wife did not cancel your booking! She, uh, looks busy. Okay, computer. Hey, we got a name. Profile picture. Password hint. Me in sexy aliens. Huh. I wonder if there are clues to her password. I don't think I have enough information to crack it yet. The PC is on, but the person who works at this desk seems to be on a break. They only have a single person answering the hotline right now? That's surprising. Hey. What else we got here? Oh, Mary's in this office, probably. So. Let's have a look at this. Employee of the month. Happy. Fixed. 
insert photo here. Lazy layout. Oh. Freddy. Freddy sucks. That's not a nice guy. Rufus. Particularly appreciated. Just come in. Let's have a look. Hey, Ernst. Oh, the that's the room seemed to promise well kept secrets and rumors. What a fancy nameplate. It says Ernst. It's a letter for an application for a promotion to senior customer service agent. Signed customer service. by L. Angst. Okay. Happy kid. Identical age. Twins. Uh huh. frame high quality Ooh, what's this oh hinge a secret compartment uh -huh. is it normal to have a huge painting of your family in your office it is for this guy Oops. keep just knocking things over uh -huh. angry stern Food, family man. See, all the good on him. Thai, expensive branch manager. Okay, gonna be able to start putting some names together here. Branch manager Stern. So if we go back. Burns. planning on staying in my office much longer I'll have to inspect the entire premise to do my job correctly <sighs> well hurry up okay branch man okay something okay let's go have a look okay now I shouldn't go outside yet I have uh. to find out who the people in this office are first did I remember to write down their professions and my deductions hope so the deductions here yeah. must be the crime scene first crime I want to find out who the people in the office are it will make things easier in the long run. I'll need to remember to write everything down in my deductions. Okay. Okay, okay. So... And, and that makes you... Who was the other? Luck. Okay. So you end up with luck. The 
that makes you Lord, which means he has your coffee cup. See if we can find the other people. The two desks on this side look unused. Okay, Let's see if they're off the phone yet. This is Bearbus. How can I help you? Uh, your yarn ball is still on the bus. Which route were you on? I need to ask you some questions. No, I'm sorry. You can't take your 12 trombones on the bus. What? Oh, can't you see I'm talking to a customer? It's company oh. policy. Nothing I can do. Goodbye. Do you know anything about who called me here? What are you talking about? Listen, I have a million more emails to answer, and there are hmm, 50 people in the phone queue. I have worked 10 days in a row, including three night shifts, and Manfred still doesn't want to give me a raise! Just leave me a piece! So... You have no clues for me? Okay. Manfred. Haha. <laughs> okay. Yes, you see, the bear is Manfred, and he is the branch manager. Cat is customer service. Cardinal is called. Oh, works at operating office. There you go. Okay. Okay, so we need a couple of work titles. Was it you who called me? No, I never heard of you before. That's unusual. It's good you're here, since there has been some unrest. Rest. Now, interesting enough. We could show the co-worker as a clue. What is your relationship with Sophie Windheimer? Excuse me for a second. Oh man, I don't know how I'd survive the office without her. Oh, that's Beth nice. Is at the reception. I would have loved to have her in the office. I'm back. Yes, please collect your toddler from the bus station. Oh, um, that would be... that would be ideal. What do you think about Manfred Ernst? Oh, he's a great guy. I just wish I'd finally get a raise. Yes, yeah, sorry, this is Bear Bus. Your bus will be three hours late. Ooh, three hours. Ouch. Okay. We're getting some Sophie reception. Okay. We need those. Let's see. What do you know about Manfred Ernst? I think he likes me. He's the only one who doesn't shout at me. Ah, I see, I see, I see, I see. Let's go out to the reception. Ooh, kitty cat. So, do you have an idea who would have hired me? It's about the incident, isn't it? Um, incident. Sorry, no idea. Okay. Okay. We'll go back to the, the manager. Says Ernst. 
It's a letter for an application for a promotion to senior customer service agent. Signed by L. Angst. Angst. Oh, Lord Angst. Uh huh. Okay. Uh, you're still it. I have a feeling you're not enjoying my company. Not particularly. Uh huh. Now we can ask you. Laura Angst. Oh, she's a fantastic employee. She nice. She basically does the work of five people. It's a bit of judgment. Okay. So I think we need... Freddy's last name. Okay. It's a list of all the bus drivers. The most busy driver out of all four seems to be Petrovich. Okay. Ready. No, nope, that's her. Ernst. Bad eyesight. Hmm. Mr. Duck Detective? Airbus. Hmm. Have to been a hint. Detective work isn't easy. The thing that the details. in particular was... Missing clue Did I really inspect everything there was in and around the office? It's important to talk to everyone and question them about evidence as well. I always had the option to check the map in my notebook. <sighs> Let's check the map in the notebook. understand why such a small office needs a reception I'm just here to keep the angry customers out <laughs> what can you tell me about Laura angst Laura needs to chill out I do love her but if she keeps living like this she'll have a heart attack by 23 oh, that's not good So what are we missing? Well, we... Still missing something. Laura? Laura? Crocodile. Cold. So we're missing, missing him. Okay, mm. so we need to put the last name in the book. I think that's it. Ready? out these names I was ready to check out the crime scene let's see where that lunch got stolen from then I could finally talk to my client 
I'm inclined as the last person missing, eh? As soon as I entered the kitchen, the comforting waft of cheap white toast entered my nostrils. Oh, no toast. <sighs> I knew I had to stay strong. This wasn't what I was here for. Stop eating the icing! Can't you wait a couple hours? Margaret, if it wasn't for these pants almost bursting, I'd have this for breakfast every day. Yes, yes, and you can have it and so much more later, when we're done preparing. Let's see. Ah, okay. Let's have a look here. Spotless hair. Pegapaya, well groomed. Scrap baker, motherly. Let's see. Tan line, divorced. Got it. Yes, dear. I'm Eugene McQuacklin, detective, and I need to ask some questions. A detective? How exciting! What's the most gruesome murder you've seen? Ooh. How many dead bodies have you encountered? Oh, five little pigs. No one died, but I investigated a case once where five little pigs robbed a bank. Caught them red-handed and got myself an article in the Goose Times. They called it the Piggy Bank Case. Did someone get shot? What? No! She's oh, beaten up! Uh, no. She's aggressive. Hmm. Okay. What do you, do you think, think of Sophie Windheimer? She doesn't have the easiest life, you know. She just had a terrible breakup with her ex. But don't tell anyone! Can you tell me anything about Laura Angst? Oh, she's such a hard-working girl. I heard she secretly studies for her online bachelor's during work. Ooh. You need to keep this a secret, though. Do you know anyone here who could have hired me? Hmm. To be honest, everyone was quite shocked by the lunch theft. And no one told me they've called a detective. I don't know what's going on at all. Because you talk too much. Waddle over here. So what's going on? Halloween party. Hey. Okay. Cancelled. Oh no, the party's cancelled. Hungry? Get your own lunch. Huh. Angry milk. Looking for editor unpaid. Hey. Okay. Office parties are a bad idea anyway. They stopped doing them at the precinct after the, uh, jam incident. I have a feeling he was the reason for the jam incident. I was unimpressed. Oh, I think this is the employee of the month. Work shoes. Practical person. Toolbox. Janitor. Sticker. Sci-fi fan. Ah uh -huh. Got him pegged. Dishwasher's broken again. What's wrong with these youngsters? Don't know how to treat things with respect. Why would they put the mugs in face up? Mm -hmm. I'm a private detective, and I'm here to investigate a case. Is that so? I need to find my client. Do you know who it could be? Uh, Freddy's a bit of a weird one, so I'd imagine you would call a detective. Personally, I feel we're doing just fine. And don't need no messing about our business around here. CSE. Do you get along with Manfred Ernst? Mm, he's a stubborn one. I do respect that. Would you say see you that. enjoy Freddy Ferdersen's, uh, company? Huh. If anyone needs to learn to respect their elders, 
It's that moron. Okay. I think we can put some names on. And his name is Rufus. Uh, you know that. Maybe that's not. Well, that kind of. It looks like a small place. Good luck. Okay. Good luck. There you go. Okay. Nice. Surely you must have some interesting stories. Oh, let's not talk about. Question. About clues. Good and clues. Okay. What's with the microwave? Oops. I doubt they wash their hands after leaving that greasy handprint. Ah, greasy hair. What's this? Margaret? First name? Cat paw? Thanks for the food. Greasy. Sharp claws. Note. Thief. Salami bandit. Ah, oh, so Rufus's last name is something so, with an S. This must be the crime scene. This note is curious. Rufus. Ha. <laughs> Got it. Nice. Lights. Okay, if we still need to find out who hired us. We can do was stolen by somebody known as the Salami Bandit. Ah, uh, we Margaret works at customer service to Penguin. Rufus works as janitor. And Buffalo. Ooh, there's another person we're missing. Okay, but they're the one who hired us. wondered what kind of sorry soul was standing all alone in the rain. Let's find out. The portion was handsome. Ooh. Oh. Hands in pockets. Bad manners. Boris. Hey. Bus driver. And this isn't the bus stop. You'll have to walk south to the central bus station. What? I'm not here to take a bus. I'm investigating a case here at Bear Bus. Oh, <laughs> do you mean the lunch that got stolen? Yeah. Exactly. You know who called me? Nah, too busy minding my own business. I don't talk much with the customer service folks. Hey, who do you talk with? Of Sophie Windheimer. <sighs> Man, I wish she'd let me talk to her. <sighs> do you, um, like Freddy Frederson? He's a pretty funny dude. Loves to rant about detective novels. What do you know about Rufus Sedaris? I don't think he likes me very much, to be honest. But then, doesn't feel like he likes anyone at this office. Hmm. Mm. Except for Margaret, I guess. Do you think they have a thing going on? <sighs> I don't work here. I thought you were a detective. Yeah, not our case. Okay. More suspects. So... Let's try. But it doesn't give us the name yet. Okay. Okay. 
We'll keep looking. left their bag here. Ugh. It's full of dirty chim clothes. Case files added. Oh, it's cold out, but if I go inside, I have to face Sophie. Uh oh, it's something. -y. What is this, Boris? So we have your name. We know who you are. Okay, looks like there's no more clues. We have to uh, Morris. Okay, there you go. Morris, nice. Now that I had everyone's name and job, it would be easier to figure out what was going on. Okay. Kind. We just need to find out who hired us. Do you Jump know back. anything about this bag? Oh, it's really strange. Things in it disappeared, and others appeared. Very suspicious. Oh. What are you even talking about? Is this your bag? No. No. Oh. Everyone here is being really unhelpful. Yeah. I think it's their job to be helpful. It's our job to find out what's going on. Okay, let's talk to you now. Uh -huh. Can you tell me more about Freddy Frederson? Let me put you on hold while I find the route for you. Freddy? Oh. More than me. Can you imagine that? What an incompetent waste of office space. Hello, this is Laura again. I checked the bus routes and found that. Very quick. Okay. What can you tell me about Margaret Whitlock? She gets really angry with me when I don't return mugs to the kitchen. Um. Why don't you just oh. return them? I do! Uh, just not every day. You have like four mugs on your table and one in your hand. Is this your bag? Huh? No, mine's over there. The one with all the salami? <laughs> yeah! Why do you need so much salami? It's not mine. It was just there. A really nice surprise. Do you get along with Boris Petrovich? He's a chill guy. I take the bus sometimes to go to bouldering conventions, and then we get to chat. So, Salami Bandit, and you have Salami, but you're saying it's not yours. Suspicious. What are you doing with my family's portrait? Ah, no Sorry. touchy. What hey. can you tell me about Boris Petrovich? He's uh, not the most reliable worker. Uh, but it's difficult finding replacements nowadays. Okay. Let's have a look here. Thanks for the lunch. Salami bandit. It has a cat paw on it. Okay. Let's do this. Oh, it's Laura. 
Oh, hello. So it was Laura who called me. I needed to discuss the case with her. Makes sense. She was on the phone. You're and my she was client. Oh, why didn't you tell me? Can I put you on hold for a second? Ah, what? Well, you should have told me. You're the duck detective. What are you? I'm a duck. I'm wearing a trench coat. So is Freddy getting fired or what? <sighs> I'm uh, working on it. Ugh. It can't be that hard. Sorry, I'm back. Yes, let me walk you through the booking process. It was time that I found out what happened with the lunch theft and what they were planning in the kitchen. 